No, that didn't kill him! He's on zero health! How did that not kill him? <sighs> hey everyone, and welcome back to another video here on the Strawberry Jam channel today. Hopefully you guys are all doing absolutely amazing, because if you're not, well, I, I don't know. I don't even know why. I always I always seem to put myself in that predicament where I'm like, well, if you're not, uh, leave. But I don't want you to leave if you're not doing too good, because I want to make you feel better, bro. But yes, we're back with some more Minecraft Sky Wars on the Strawberry Jam channel. What's what's new about that, bro? Holy cow, guys. You did what? What the? What the? What? What? Um, uh, did I just did that guy TNT cannon himself to the middle? All right, th thanks for the stuff, bro. I guess. Oh, I feel kind of bad. I watched him die right in front of me. But yeah, guys, Sky Wars has been uh an interesting. <laughs> Sky Wars has been interesting for me for the past couple days. It's you guys may or may not know. I've been grinding out clips for my montage. I linked a bit of my montage in the last episode of Sky Wars or my last uh whatever you call these videos, one of these cut comms. And uh, I feel like I wanted to leak just a little bit more of it today. So uh you know, here's another little leak of the uh the, the Sky Wars uh, montage. I'm so in love with you. I'm a cheat, apparently. I'm a cheat because I killed that guy. But yeah, it's uh, it's coming along great. I, I'm halfway done with it. I, well, I'd say, like, half of the half that I've done is, like, it, you know, like, cinematic stuff and, like, you know, the, you know, the basic, like, introduction to the, to the montage. And then the other minute is sort of just me, uh, you know, the clips that I've hit so far. So I'd say about 50% of the work I've put in so far is clips and uh, I've, I've grinded out quite a few clips. But I gotta definitely hit a lot more... Uh, and we might be hitting one right now that's gonna be in the montage. Oh, okay, what's this guy doing? He's on seven health. He's making a... What, what is he doing? See, this is the thing that's so hard about hitting shots like this in freaking Sky Wars. You never know what people are gonna do. You never know what people's play styles are like. Okay, this guy's got eggs. Okay, he's on eight health. If I hit him once and I hit him again, and then I... Oh, well, well my mouse is gonna get caught like that, and I'm just gonna... Look like an idiot. <laughs> Going for clips like that is definitely interesting, uh, especially when your freaking mouse gets caught at the end of your freaking desk and you just sort of spin around awkwardly and you don't really, you know, hit anything when you shoot your arrow. It's different though. It's fun. It's uh, it's interesting. Uh, it's something that isn't really done often in Minecraft, so I'm glad I can, you know, sort of be doing something different. And uh, and yeah, it's just been fun, like playing Sky Wars a little bit differently since I've sort of got, you know, used to like the regular like, Sky Wars gameplay. Like I can pretty much win any game of Sky Wars I get put into now. It's not much of a challenge for me anymore so you know going for stuff like this you know where the game winning kill is like you know me doing a 360 or a 720 or a 1080 or that probably not 1080 because i can barely do a 720 stuff like that is definitely a lot more fun to go for uh and you know you feel more satisfied when stuff like that happens so it's what i've really been like focusing on for the past uh you know, few days and stuff while playing Sky Wars. and the thing is every now and again we get a game mode like this and uh where there's zombies everywhere. Oh god. Oh god. We got a game where there's freaking zombies and stuff everywhere, and it's uh it's a little bit frustrating because uh I sort of don't really care. I don't really want the zombies. I sort of just wanna I just wanna kill people. Okay, what about that one? Is that going anywhere? Uh yes. Looks like it did. That's a good thing. This one's the definitely the most annoying one, dude. Freaking zombie apocalypse, because it just ah makes people camp so freaking much in their freaking spawns and they just don't come out. They're too scared to come out. And then the zombies just uh sort of stalk you and break every block in the side. Look at this crap, dude. I'm not I'm trying to PvP, bro. Where's this last guy at? Where's this freaking last guy? Oh, oh no, I'm gonna get thrown off by zombies. Guys over here. He's got 11 health. Okay, I see how it is. Maybe I can do something interesting here. Dude, this is insane. The freaking zombies are digging to her, bro. Oh god, they're gonna No no no! Oh ho 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 ho! Where is she? Oh my god! What's up, girl? Okay, well, this isn't fun. Well, I guess, uh, you know what, you can, you can just take that victory, you know, I don't want anything to do with that. But, uh, yeah, you guys know what's up, uh, stuff and things, uh, that's what's been going on, enough to chat about the montage, some of you probably don't even care about it. But yeah, I said it'll be probably around, like, New Year's when uh, that thing comes out, but it'll probably be, it. <sighs> I said it'll be New Year's when it comes out, but, uh, it'll probably be out a little bit earlier. I don't want it to be near, like, Christmassy, I sort of want it to be, like, before Christmas. Um, or like a lot after Christmas because I feel like stuff around Christmas should be, you know, like holiday themed, but, um, maybe that's just me being weird. Okay. You don't need to be there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where's your, where the heck is your knockback? You freaking cheater. Okay. How, how to cheat, how to cheat 101 with your boy Roman 305 in the hood. All right. Let's get you out of here. There we go. Oh, no, no. Close one. Close. Come to me, little naked man. Come to me. Oh, oh. 
Oh, oh, now you. Oh, God. Why is everyone just like. Oh. Why? Be gone! Oh! There we go. Okay, let's kill the freaking cheetah. Because, uh, oh no, I'm all out of arrows. How much health is the cheetah on? Seven? Get out of here, cheetah. Come on. No one likes a freaking cheetah, you piece of trash. Oh, you're the freaking girl who killed me before. Do you get out of here? No, 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 no. Oh, oh god, oh god, oh god. And Vanessa, you too. You too. Bye bye, Vanessa. I love you, but, um, yeah, not cool. Vanessa, how'd you live? There we go. There we go. <laughs> oh, man. What, what is the. Steve, come on, man. What are you doing, dude? You're. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. All right, I see what he's trying to do. See what he's trying to achieve. Oh, this guy's just gonna fall off by himself, isn't he? No, don't fall off. Don't fall off, buddy. I need you, man. I need you. Okay, here, let's do this, this. Okay. <laughs> let's hit you once more. And let's try and do one of these. Well, I freaking missed, but I just... <laughs> I still won the game. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you hit some or you just you missed 95 percent of them uh, i changed my desktop background today i've never really changed my desktop background on this computer before it's always just actually i don't know i never really ever changed my desktop background on any computer i don't know why i always have windows up above my computer so why would i need to look at my desktop background like ever because like i just have a window over it but i was like hey man why don't i just change my desktop background because like why the heck not how did I take damage? How did I take damage? I just freaking just pulled a will from UHC season 14. Apparently the water's shallower than I thought it was. But yeah, I changed my desktop background. So if you guys care about it, it's this picture. It's a beautiful picture of New York City. Now here's an interesting top. I wouldn't necessarily say New York is my favorite city in the world, but it's like, it has to be up there as one of my top favorite cities. I don't know if I'm biased for saying this, but I feel like my number one favorite city in the world is Melbourne. I don't know if it's because I live here or I was brought up here. Or I just like, I don't know. It's just, or it actually just is my favorite city. But I freaking love Melbourne, dude. Melbourne is such a nice city. It's so clean. It's so multicultural. It's so much cool stuff to do. And I just, I'm, I'm proud. I'm proud to say that I live in Melbourne, dude. Like I would consider it like one of the best cities in the world. Without being biased, I'm trying my best not to be biased, but uh, I feel like it is like, what the heck? Did, did you just see him freaking jerk his head like that? That was creepy. But I feel really biased saying that Melbourne's one of my favorite cities in the world. Even even when I talk to like my friends, they say I'm biased for saying that because, you know, I live here. But like, I, I would say it's definitely up there, dude. I mean, look up like most livable cities in the world, dude. Melbourne's like way up there just because it's it's actually like one of the most livable cities in the freaking world. And then, don't you dare, don't you dare, don't you dare. <laughs> oh, no, don't, oh, dude. Oh, oh, come on, come on, go bye-bye. Go bye-bye, you can't stay on that ladder. You can't. <laughs> what if I just fell? But even though Melbourne, I feel like, is such a nice, beautiful city, and like, for all the reasons why I love it, there's just one thing that annoys me about it, and it's why I just can't wait for the future. I feel like over my teenage years of just being free and, you know, willing, like, you know, getting let to explore the world and such, I feel like just over, like, the past few years, I felt like I've been everywhere in Melbourne. Like, I feel like the main downfall of the city is, I mean, a positive about it is it's, like, not too big. Like, it's a decent-sized city but it's not huge it's a positive but it's also a negative because if you're a resident here you sort of just run out of things to do i don't know maybe maybe it's just me maybe it's just because i haven't explored enough of it or just something but like i just i've ran out of things to do in melbourne dude like it's just i i don't know there's there's not many places in melbourne where i'm like oh yeah i haven't seen that that seems interesting i feel like all the places that i wanted to check out and all the places that i probably will like would check out i've checked out and i feel like that's the reason why new york excites me so much like i would love it if like melbourne and new york were mixed because like we would have like the size of new york mixed with like the cleanliness and like beautifulness of melbourne like i've been to new york before and i wish i could just go outside and be like oh without having to like you know feel like i'm gonna die of like some weird like disease new york air and just air in like a lot of american cities in general just isn't like clean dude what i have to go through to hit these clips guys i literally have to like mess around with these little nudes for so long <laughs> oh my god what can i do to this guy what can i possibly do to him well i'm in a hole now can i get out well, I killed him. I don't even know where I'm going with this freaking topic. I, I'm, I'm lost. I was lost after I freaking had to fight that guy. He, he gave me a freaking headache, dude. Yeah, if there's anyone out there who wants to explore New York with me for a couple of years, uh, hit me up. Uh, if you're hot, uh, marry me and, you know, we can, uh, we can, I need, I need that green card. So, uh, 
you know, we'll we'll uh, we'll just you know we'll uh, we'll settle down and just outside of New York, have a couple babies, and uh, every single day I'll just walk into the city and hold your hand and make more babies. Uh, what? Oh, Strawberry Jam comes in for the cleanup kill, gets the double kill on both of them. I bet those boys are so bad right now. And he's getting hit behind. He's gonna ride, ride, ride. He's not gonna hit the rod. He's gonna he's gonna swing it around. He's gonna block with his sword. He's gonna get the double hit, triple hit quad combo and he gets the final kill there's a pretty funny comment on my video uh from a couple days ago people someone said uh strobe you shouldn't be hitting clips like that that's huawei's job i come to your videos to see people fail and get mad why are you getting good i'm like i'm sorry man i didn't i didn't do it on purpose like it was just an accident I don't know if you guys saw my video from like a day or so, whenever, I don't know, I'm, I'm pre-recording so many videos, I can't even keep track. But I sort of talked about Minecon and how it was such a good, um, such a nice trip and such a good experience meeting so many like various people. Looking back on it, I am so surprised about how many YouTubers I met. How many YouTubers I met. Like, I literally, like, I'd started the year meeting, like, a couple YouTubers. And now, at the end of the year, I've easily met over a hundred of, like, the most subscribed YouTubers of, like, Minecraft YouTubers in the world. And I've even met the like, most subscribed YouTuber in the world. I met my boy PewDiePie at freaking PAX this year, dude. That's insane. <sighs> Come on, man. Why you gotta do that? That would have been sick. Just a little mid-air, just... I guess since I'm, like, heading towards the end of the year, like, it's... I, I guess a lot of people do this. Since it's getting towards the end of the year, I tend to, like, look back a lot, and I'm just, like, so thankful. Like, I, I definitely don't say that enough, and I I don't know. I guess no YouTuber says it enough. I can't thank you guys enough for the uh, opportunity and, like, the position that you guys have put me in, and I, I'm so thankful for everything that you guys have given me. Like, I, I don't know how else to say it. Like, I could literally sit here saying thank you for hours and hours on end. I could read out every single one of your names but i couldn't even read out like every single person who's watched my video because who doesn't count that but you guys have no idea how thankful i am like literally every day i wake up just being so thankful about the position that i'm in like it's it's insane and i just splashed myself with poison so um that's not how oh god that's not how you play the game but we just got a sick bow so i feel like this game has been won oh you have arrows for me don't you no don't don't fall off the edge stay on the island no. <gasps> God dang it. Every time that you want something from someone, they're literally just gonna jump off with it, dude. Like, why you gotta do that, man? You probably have arrows, and you're probably- No, 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 stay right here. You're perfect. Perfect. You're gonna kill me, though. Oh my god. Lag? Yeah, I know, bro. The freaking lag, dude. I know nothing about it. It's not like I'm from freaking Australia. That's like the single-handed most thing that will forever annoy me about Minecraft. I hate it when people tell me, Strobe, you're lagging. And I'm like, yeah, I know. I can tell. Like, my- like, you guys are literally, like, jumping around, like, teleporting on my screen. Like, I know, dude, when I shoot a bird, the arrow comes out, like, 20 seconds later. Oh, yeah, dude, I know, trust me, I get stuck in a block every time I break it. People have the need to tell me, like, oh, you're lagging. And, like, I'm, I'm like, sitting here just, like, in awe, like, the fact that someone's had to go out of their way to say that. I know I'm lagging, bro, just so shut up! Oh, crap, I told you guys something that annoys me. Now everyone's gonna freaking do it. Did that really just happen? Oh, no, I didn't kill him. No. 